Bone Marrow Transplant Procedure Let's delve deeper into the bone marrow transplant procedure, a remarkable medical process that can transform lives. The most important part is preparation of bone marrow transplant procedure. Before the actual transplant, the patient goes through a meticulous preparation phase. This phase involves a series of intense chemotherapy or radiation sessions. The goal is to eradicate the diseased or malfunctioning bone marrow and make space for the new, healthy marrow to grow. These treatments can be physically and emotionally challenging for the patient. They often lead to side effects such as fatigue, nausea, and a weakened immune system. The patient's medical team closely monitors their response to these therapies to ensure they are ready for the transplant. Then comes another important part which is donor search for transplants. Finding a compatible donor is a crucial and often time-consuming step. The most favorable donors are usually siblings since they are more likely to share similar HLA markers, increasing the chance of a successful transplant. However, if a suitable sibling donor isn't available, an unrelated donor may be sought through bone marrow registries. This is where HLA matching comes into play. Human leukocyte antigen, or HLA, refers to a set of proteins found on the surface of cells. HLA testing identifies specific genetic markers in the donor and recipient. The more closely these markers match, the lower the risk of complications post-transplant. The matching process involves testing multiple HLA genes, making it critical to find a compatible donor. Now let's learn about the bone marrow transplant procedure. Once a compatible donor is identified, the bone marrow transplant procedure proceeds. This involves the actual extraction of healthy bone marrow from the donor. The most common method is a minimally invasive procedure called a bone marrow harvest. In this process, the donor typically lies face down, and bone marrow is aspirated from the pelvic bone using a needle and syringe. While the donor may experience some discomfort during and after the procedure, it is generally well tolerated, and the body replenishes the lost marrow within a few weeks. After the harvest is done, the doctors then prepare of infusion. With the donor marrow collected, it is then transported to the recipient's location. The transplant itself is a relatively simple process. The healthy bone marrow is infused into the recipient's bloodstream through a central venous catheter, similar to a blood transfusion. From there, the healthy stem cells travel to the recipient's bones, where they begin to produce new blood cells. This infusion marks the beginning of a complex but hopeful journey for the patient. The healthy donor cells are like seeds planted in the recipient's body, and they need time to take root and grow. At the end it is about recovery so post-transplant, the patient enters a period of close monitoring and recovery. This phase is critical as it carries the risk of complications, including infections, graft-versus-host disease, GVHD, and organ damage. GVHD is a condition where the donor's immune cells recognize the recipient's tissues as foreign and mount an immune response against them. The most crucial aspect after BMT is done is to manage GVHD and other potential complications as it requires careful medical supervision, including medications to suppress the immune response and ensure the graft takes hold. The patient's progress is closely tracked through blood tests and clinical evaluations. In summary, a bone marrow transplant is not just a medical procedure. It's a journey of hope, resilience, and transformation. It represents the amazing potential of modern medicine to offer a new lease on life to those facing blood-related disorders. As always, it's crucial to consult with a dedicated medical team for a comprehensive understanding of your unique circumstances and the potential benefits and risks of a bone marrow transplant. Thank you for joining us on this in-depth exploration of bone marrow transplants. If you or someone you know is considering this procedure, remember that you're not alone on this journey.